Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma 2. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we are going to continue exploring this camp. Um, I think it's like a... Uh, or something like that some kind of military installment we're gonna explore that uh, I did hear somebody talking about they needed a quest done or something uh, I, I couldn't really pay attention I was trying to explore I got quite a bit of stuff done I explored all through these areas I didn't find any quest second quest in Melv matter of fact let's get rid of that the only person, or well, the only thing I found was somebody yelling about something over here. And yeah, and I did go into a house right over here. There is a little bit of a cutscene, and I also fought a second ogre right over here. Oh, one more thing. I leveled up my vocation. So our vocation is now at level five. I have a bunch of different uh, stats along with Lucy. I leveled up her vocation stuff as well. We got quick spell now that is OP. I love it. And magic bolt. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Where was that person at? I think he was right here. In it. We're running low on everything. From provisions to crafting materials for weapons and armor. We've had a hard time procuring goods, what with all the monsters lurking on the roads of late. I sent Marcus to gather what we need, but I've just taken stock and I fear the list I gave him was incomplete. What say you? Could I trouble you to run an errand for me? <laughs> You'd be paid, of course. Sure, I'll run your errand. Glad to hear it. Here, take this list of additional supplies to Marcus. He ought to be somewhere north of here. Hand him the note and he'll take care of the rest. Oh, one other thing, too, that... Okay, that's not far from where we are. There was, I think it was, yes, over here. There was somebody over by this riftstone. I didn't talk to him because I didn't know if there was a quest or anything like that. I want to go over here and see what this is about next. It's kind of a far run, but shouldn't take us too too long to get it done. Or get over there is what I mean. Get it done. I don't know what I'm talking about, everybody. And Why do I not complete our delivery while we're here? We need only pass our burden into the hands that await it. I quite agree. Okay, like I was saying, I did level up my gear. Got some new gear in Melv. Figured while I was over there, I might as well gear up. Ooh, Saurian. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our favor. We must not let down our guard. Well done. Let my magic grant you an elemental boon. Oh, that's awesome. That was close. That was a cool fight. That was well fought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. Overconfidence is an enemy in and of itself. Let us instead strive to better ourselves with every battle.
We have reached our destination. That's everything assembled. A job well done, if I do say so myself. Oi! Did you need something? Deliver the papers. This is from Sir Geoffrey, is it? Let's have a look then. Why? He wants these as well, does he? I thought I was finished. Why should I have to do all this on my own? I've got plenty to carry as teeth. Say, your arms look free. You can handle that list in my stead. And make haste. I would depart for the encampment even a moment sooner. Well, go on. You know what to do. We shall have to scour, high and low. Um... What provisions... Gather three hearth spuds. I think I have some hearth spuds and two salbarius droughts for Marcus. Um, I know I have some hearth spuds in the my. Items on this list can be crafted by combining certain materials, and I happen to know where they can be found. I can guide you to the place, Arisen, or thereabouts. We're in your hands, sir. Much obliged. Pray follow me. I know the way, so there's no chance of our getting lost. Okay, well, somebody picked up a horse spud. Wherever that was. The items on this list can be crafted by combining certain materials. And I happen to know where they can be found. I can guide you to the place, Arisen, or thereabouts. I want to see if I can We're craft them, because I don't Much want to... Um... Have to buy them or anything like that. Over here, if you please. Sure. Where are you? Like in the bushes or some shit, lady? <laughs> Tis this way. Are we going? I don't know. Some sometimes the pawns are a little weird. She's like, "I'll show you where it is. Let me just stand here." A common reward, frustratingly so. We cannot expect gleaming treasures round every corner. It's true. Okay, let's go back to camp and see if we don't have some of that stuff. Not camp, whatever. The, the encampment. items on this list can be crafted by combining certain materials, and I happen to know where they can be found. I can guide you to the place, Arisen, or thereabouts. I don't care. I We're really don't care, hands, lady. Sir. Much obliged. Let's go into our chest or storage. Sorry, I seen a chest over here. I was like, maybe it's up there. Go into our storage. This, looks this ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your boat. Withdraw. Horse bud. We need three. I think somebody picked up one. What else do we need? Salomon's brew or some shit. Right? Salaburus drow or whatever. I can't pronounce that. I think we needed one or two. Mission. Come see me anytime. Always a pleasure. Shall we report our results? Okay. Cool. Well, that was easy peasy. Time to be heading home. It's good to save uh, stuff. Good to be a loot goblin every now and then. Just hoard all your loot. Green wash.
that's another reason uh, why I like to loot off screen is so I can get some of that stuff that is just monotonous looting and arrived. running around. Nothing's really happening. I'm sure that's pretty boring to watch. Let's go ahead and give uh, this stuff to... I forget what this guy's name is. How goes it? Marcus. Have you gathered everything on the list yet? I have, Marcus. Brilliant. I knew I could count on you. Here, take this for your trouble. I'll be heading back to the encampment now. They'll be expecting me. Okay, let's go over to here. We're going to go over here, check out what this guy's got to say, and then we're going to start making our way down over this way. So we'll put a marker right there. Hopefully I can find... Sir Marcus was well pleased, Master. Shall we report our success to Sir Geoffrey? Oh, I guess we gotta go Allow talk me to... Allow to guide you, Master. I know the person you're looking for. <laughs> These the fucking pawns, welcome. man. Now we shan't lose our way. There's something else. They're always talking. Always talking. We have reached our destination. Oi, many thanks for passing on that list to Marcus for me. As I hear it, you even assisted him in gathering the supplies. <laughs> I hope it wasn't too much trouble. Anyway, you've been a great help. I hope I can count on your aid again should the need arise. Our efforts have seen the many thanks for helping us replay. Okay. I think we need to go out this way. Tis a glad thing oh, we rested when we did. We must not go down our guard. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. Well done, master. Hopefully I'm going the right way. I should bring out my map, but I think we'll be all right without it. We're going to run by some of these fights, I think, just to save some time. Ooh. I cannot fall to power. I merely did as duty demands. Splendid. I know I said it was I was like we're gonna run by some of these fights some of them are just really easy is this even a path I guess so of course I shan't let them harm you this ends here. Ow. Trying to figure out how to jump on these guys' heads. I don't know what it is. Oh well. I'll figure it out eventually. I'll do it uh, when I'm not recording. Goodness. We're higher up than I thought. Take care not to fall. Careful now. Hopefully we're getting close. I grant you fire blaze. Use it well. Yeah, we're just going to fight.
Um, I could have swore there was somebody One here. See far to the distance from here. Okay, well, that was a waste of time. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut and get rid of this real quick. And I'm going to travel all the way over here where we left the guy uh, from last video. I'll meet everybody over here. And then we'll continue going down this way and exploring until we get here. So I will see everybody in just a second. All righty, we're back here. It was only a second for you guys, but it was quite a minute to make it over here. An ox cart ought to make our Let's go to our map. Gregor wants us to travel with him, but I don't know if I want to. I kind of want to make my own way, but man, that is, it's actually kind of far. Hmm. Maybe, maybe we should, uh, Few talk to him. Are to be found in the main road, though carts travel only by the sun's light. Ooh, that made me heavy. Yeah, let's go with Gregor. I suppose there can be no harm in bringing this along. We cannot expect gleaming treasures around every corner. Or not? What is it? Changed your mind? Sure, we'll accompany you to the capital. Very well. Board the ox cart and we'll be off. Uh, can we sit? <laughs> Are we going to have to watch the whole time? Because maybe we should have walked if so. Oh, doze off. Okay. Goblins! What rotten luck! We've need of your aid again, sir. I'm a goner. Okay. Let's fight some goblins. Battle is upon us. That's cool. We can be attacked in the ox cart. It's not like just a fade to black. This battle is ours. I grant you fire's blaze. Well. Seems we drove them off. You've my thanks for aiding us. Vernworth isn't far from here. Will you join us the rest of the way? Sure. All right. Into the ox cart then. Can I doze off again? No. Oh. Never mind. I was informed of your coming would be arisen. Captain Brandt, this individual summoned a pawn through a rift stone. Several witnesses can attest to it. Though I admit I had my doubts at first, it would seem this is no mere deceiver. 
This one's not a bad sort. Saved our hides on the way here. As decreed by the great will of our world, there can only be one arisen. That arisen now resides within the palace. Indeed, he is our sovereign and the rightful ruler of Vermont. It follows, therefore, that this ruffian before us is naught but a pretender. You must submit to questioning. If you value your... Oops. I shall conduct the interrogation myself. Stand watch outside. I beg your forgiveness for my insolence, Your Majesty. Sorry, I didn't mean to um, skip that dialogue just a minute ago. If the Queen Regent had learned of your existence, I fear your life would have been in peril. I had no choice but to treat you as a pretender, lest my actions draw suspicion from watchful eyes. Uh... Then you have truly lost your memory? In that case, mayhap I ought to explain the situation before we proceed. You, and no other, are the sovereign, the only legitimate ruler of this kingdom. Some days passed, you confronted the dragon in the village of Melv, whereupon you became arisen. The people rejoiced, for our true liege had finally appeared. And in Vermont's long years of council rule, yet not all celebrated your coming. Your arrival would have robbed the Queen Regent Deesa of everything. During the time of the previous council, she acted as a queen in her own right, ruling the palace as she saw fit. And just after the council's passing, when twas all but certain that her son would take his father's place. Word reached the castle that the Arisen had been found. To Deesa, your majesty's very existence is naught but an obstacle to her own family's continued prosperity. The assassination of the Arisen is an impossible feat for mortal hands. Thus, Deesa chose to abduct your majesty while you recovered from your wounds, in order to rob you of your memory with a fell curse and sell you to Batal as a slave. Following that, she prepared a replacement to serve as the sovereign in your stead, a mere puppet. However, with your majesty returned, I have no intention of twiddling my thumbs as Deesa plays her games. I shall devise some plans to further our cause. Pray, visit me a night in a tavern that we might discuss them. This one's cleared of all suspicion and has my permission to remain in the capital. You are to trouble the good sir no further. Are we clear? <laughs> I'll read that later. Pray forgive me, I'm in a bit of a hurry. <laughs> Consarn it! Get back here! You there! Did you see an urchin in a cap run past just now? Can you tell me which way he went? Uh, nope. I don't know where he went. Many thanks. I'll catch that wretch yet. You're a kind one, aren't you? Twould seem I am in your debt. In fact, there's aught I would ask of you if you've the time to spare. Aha! There you are! Oh, apologies, but our chat will have to wait. Till next we meet. Farewell. That was interesting. I'm ready for patrol. Now this is a conundrum. Whoa, whoa. What is going on? Mayhap this ladder is here for a reason. 
Oh, excellent find. Is that the little girl we helped? Well met, sir. Forgive my presumption, but were you the one who gave my granddaughter that medicine in Melv? I thought so. <laughs> She's not stopped talking of her adventure since she arrived home. You have my sincerest thanks for aiding her. That girl's always running off on some fool's errand or other. For all my chiding. Once she gets an idea under her bonnet, there's simply no talking her out of it. Now listen, tisn't much, but I'd fain offer you a discount on my wares. Pray, make good use of it, won't you? Sure. I guess that was the girl that, uh... I brought you something. Hmm. <laughs> You're always such fun to talk to. Oh, that's freaking cool. Let's give that to Lucy. Oh, I guess I have to use it, right? Yeah. Cool. That looks promising. Any ideas as to how we might reach it? Uh, I think this might be a weaponsmith over here. I have all manner of arms for sale. Come, have yourself a look. Let's see. Let's buy that. Which is freaking expensive. Um... Let's buy that for Lucy. Yeah. And then we'll sell some stuff. I don't need this. We already have one. I'm just going to sell all this stuff. I normally like to keep it, but I'll be... Uh, looting a bunch anyways so whenever i'm looting off screen i'll keep a lot of stuff and just store it just in case we need it for later something enhance equipment Hmm. We'll hold off on it. We might get better our packs equipment. Are heavier, and our purse is far lighter. Welcome to Bjorn's Armory. You'll find only pieces of the finest quality line these shelves, and quality is what you need if you want to survive. So, if we check the price, just remember: misers die early deaths. Let's see what you have. Start with headgear. Don't <laughs> I don't particularly like that hat. That looks pretty cool. Oh, so does that. Oh, that looks even cooler. We might go ahead and get this. Do we have enough? Ooh, just enough. All right, that'll be our thing, I guess, that we are going to buy. We just spent so much money. It's ridiculous. Probably shouldn't have spent that much, but whatever. Hope to see you again. See, is there a place to sleep around here? Looks like there's a pawn summoning. Go on, have a look. 
We don't need to summon any new pawns yet. Looks like a barber there. Definitely going to be looting all of this. I guess this leads back through the shops. This must be our curatives. Guy that sells the curatives. Alright, great. <laughs> you do that. Looks like this is where we sleep. Or it's an inn. Well met. You are come to Shakir's Inn, a place of respite for the weary traveller. You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey when treated to the foremost hospitality in all Vernworth. Yeah, don't have enough money for that. <laughs> I just spent it all because I'm stupid. Put that stuff away. that away as well commerce is the domain of clever minds okay you Much got nothing obliged. important to say this inspired naught but misgivings looks like it's getting dark hopefully i think we're supposed to meet bernal bernard i don't know i don't remember his name Greetings. Welcome to the Guild Hall. Here we conduct all manner of procedures pertaining to vocations. If there is aught I may assist you with, simply say the word. Um, oh, I did find some seeker tokens while I was exploring. Have you found any of the items we discussed, Perchon? Just two. Ooh, we get a fairy stone. Cool. We haven't found a port crystal yet. Or a fairy circle or whatever. Forgive me, but I'm afraid we are not accepting registration for warriors or sorcerers at this time. You see, as we currently have no archer staves or great swords on hand, we are unable to outfit new members. And we cannot simply purchase more, as the delivery of arms intended for the local armory and other guilds in this domain was plundered by goblins. So regrettably, I cannot assist you, unless you were to procure a weapon yourself, that is. Let me see. What else can I tell you of our guild? Um, let me see, uh, I did level up recently. Deathly Arrow. That seems dope. Erupting Shot. Hmm. So that's locked. Do we not get a double jump in this one? I'd really like a double jump. We'll do that. Methinks Roderick will be able to tell you aught of the stolen shipment. He runs the local armory, and we purchase almost all of our stock from him. May fortune smile upon you, sir. We shall have to scour, high and low. Who's Roderick? This really is fine craftsmanship. This guy? Oi, friend. Klaus sent word that you've agreed to rescue some of my pilfered equipment. I'd be grateful for aught you can reclaim, truly. Fair warning. Goblins are behind these ox cart raids, I've since learned. No doubt they're hoarding the stolen arms in their den. From the tell of it, their lair lies somewhere along the western road. Pray do be careful. It, if all were to go awry, it would weigh heavily on my heart. Losing my wares for good would make me sore. But no sack of gold could compare to a fellow life, eh? Okay, so it's a good guess there because I was going to either choose the blacksmith or him. Bjorn is the blacksmith's name, or armorsmith, not blacksmith. Roderick is the blacksmith. There's a ladder here. 
We ought to put it to good use. See, is there anybody to talk to around here? What's over here? Where's it trying to send me? What is that? Is that where I need to go? Um, it's getting dark. I don't know if I want to make my way all the way over there. I kind of want to meet up with oh uh, Bernard, I think his name is. Really bad with names. I'm sorry, everybody. I see a chest over here, but it, I don't know where it's at. I'm not going to spend too much time trying to find chests. I will do that... Again, I, I know I sound like a broken record, but I'll do that off uh, screen. Oh, there's a ladder over there. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to put on the main quest. Where's the pub at? Up here. At least you don't use stamina in the towns. I do like that. The pub is... Is this the pub? No, this is the guy with the vocation. How do I get into the pub? See it right over here. Here's a sign. Hey, here's a chest too. 400 gold? <laughs> yeah, we could use that right now. Oh my goodness. I gotta say real quick before we go into this main quest. The walking mechanics and stuff feel very floaty and like you're playing The Witcher 3. I don't know if anybody's ever played The Witcher 3, but it feels very floaty um, with the movement. Kind of like that game. Your Majesty, your timing is impeccable. I just thought to call for you. Tis not a matter for prying ears. Pray, let us speak out here. I like his armor. Looks really cool. As I informed you when last we spoke, the palace is filled with the Queen Regent's sycophants. Should Deesa denounce your majesty as a false arisen, few would elect to doubt her. Yet if we are to prove your identity, I believe there is no occasion more suitable than the coronation. It was delayed so that the sovereign, that is, the false arisen, could convalesce in the palace, but the date has now been set. The central players in the court ought all be in attendance. It would be a fine opportunity to display your majesty's power. None would be able to deny that you are the true arisen then. There is a problem, however. Entry to such an event is limited to the chosen few. Only select members of the nobility and citizens who have contributed greatly to Vermont's continued prosperity will be granted entry. If your majesty is to be counted among them, you will need to attend to a number of tasks. Pray, allow me to summarize them for you. Um, tell me of the monster calling. The citizenry have called upon my soldiers to call monsters that plague the land. I dare say, it would be a fine contribution were you to accomplish these tasks unaided. What say you? Might I ask for your cooperation in this matter? Absolutely. I'll uh, take care of some monsters for you. I thank you, Your Majesty. There are three locales that I've seen significant trouble of late. The first is Travo Mine, to the northwest. We've had reports of goblins swarming in great numbers. Next is Half Village, west of Burnworth. 
I believe soldiers have already been dispatched to call an infestation of Saurians there. Finally, there is a call for someone to locate a group of soldiers tasked with delivering freight. They were last seen crossing the second bridge on the eastern edge of Vermin. There is no shortage of beasts that need culling in this world. Um, so maybe we do this one first and then we'll go over to this one and then that one because this one seems the furthest away. I guess we don't need this marker anymore. It's going to send us there anyways. So let's put a marker here. Maybe this will be a good place to put a marker. By combining our strengths, we shall overcome this trial as all others. Looks like we're going to be traveling at night regardless. How do I get out of here? Down this way and then out. Ooh. Man, that looks pretty. I know it's dark, but it, it just looks really pretty. Walking through here at night looks really pretty, too. Well, at least they put a notice out for citizens to get the hell out of the way if a monster attacks. Am I going the right way? Yeah? Okay. I am. Seems like we're gonna have to make a right here and then a left. No ghosts. A master has given us an order. Surely you do not intend to disobey. <laughs> Phantoms! We have no means of exploiting our enemy's weakness. Seriously. Oh my god. My magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. I don't know if it's wise for me to fight these ghosts here. This should help. Kill it. I have no clue if we're even really doing damage. Most ghosts won't take damage to anything but magic. So close a call offers no solace in victory. We ought to consider this a lesson. This is what befalls one who lets down their guard. I agree. I might be looking at my map quite a bit back and forth. There's an ox. Okay, we're getting up to where the fork in the road is. It's not too A far off. Endeavor. Oh. Oop. All right, I figured it out. Nice. Paths to victory are myriad indeed. That strategy never would have occurred to me. Truly? Mm. 
Well, that does it. <laughs> well done, master. Ooh, sorry, entail. That's the first time I've gotten that. Okay, I'm probably not going to fight much else. I want to get through this before we run out of Such time a here. Magnificent tapestry of stars. I quite agree. So we'll erase that, but we need to come up here and just follow this road around to about right here. Come on, guys. Don't even mess around. Oh, got some undead. When their skulls are smashed beyond repair. Looks like goblins. Of course. I'm out of stamina at the least opportune moment. Come on, guys. Don't worry about them. We could camp. But I'm not going to bother with it. Bandit. And Lucy is a beast, yo. Oops. I did not mean to do that. I miscalculated. Oh my god. You are not alone. Nix is down. That's not good. Damn it, Nix. Damn, Lucy. <laughs> She's OP, but... Man. She gets hit. Let's revive Lucy here. I don't know why we're fighting all of this. All right, let's go. I shall come at once, Arisen. That was a little much. I should not have fought that. A knight. How goes it? Say, would you consider doing me a favor? I have an errand to run that'll take me afar, friend. But what with all the troubles on the roads? I'm none too keen to face the trip on my lonesome. I don't like to be a bother, but I'd be mighty grateful if you would accompany me and help me get where I'm going in one piece. Bastion. Sure. My thanks. Oh, all the way back there. Oh, my God. Okay, well, I guess we're coming back this way. Are you? This seems a decent spot Let's go. for a campsite. <laughs> Surely a rest can wait till after we've examined our surroundings. Choppers, master! Tis weak to fire. Is he coming? Come on. Where are you going? Why are you being so difficult, bud? Let my magic draw into an elemental doom. Oh, 
Now will you move? Okay, now he'll move. Ah, we got to backtrack. So we'll do this quest, and then after this quest, uh, we'll call it um, a video. And real quick. Oh, it doesn't even tell us or it doesn't even give us a quest like a quest marker. So we just got to bring them over there. So what we'll do is we'll replace that over there. That way we know where we're going. Well, I mean, we kind of know where we're going because we can see where we've already walked. I guess it's kind of good that we uh, took care of a lot of these enemies ahead of time because now it's easier to bring him back this way. Just worried about those ghosts. Damn it. Come on. We need some holy magic. This is not an ideal situation. Oh my god, what the? Where did you come from? I believe yon foe is drawn to light. We ought to extinguish our lantern. Damn it. Lest we summon it unwittingly. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait right there. What now? Oh my god, Th this is really, really bad. I don't know what the hell is going on. Did he die? What? I failed it? <sighs> that really sucks. That really, really sucks. Did he fall in the water, you think? I think he fell in the water. Ah, uh, well, that's disappointing. So I guess we'll just go back to what we were doing. Oh my god, an ogre. <laughs> no, I don't want to fight an ogre. Or a skeleton. Hey, aren't you? My aim is true. No, we don't need to fight an ogre. Come on, guys. Let's go. That ogre gets to live today. That was like the worst case scenario that could have happened. Huh. 
Uh, let's look at the map again. So we need to come down this way and then across the bridge. So down this way. Come on, guys. What are you doing? Protect the shipment! Steal yourself! Cut the fiends down! Don't let them touch the shipment! B, how did this happen? We must defend the cargo! Oh my god, Lucy's down too. That guy's going to hit me. Ouch. Oh my god. Everything's hit me. This is like really bad, guys. I wish I had like a dodge or something. That would be nice. Can so can somebody please, I don't know, take aggro while I'm trying to heal Lucy? It's like every single time I go to heal her. She's like our glass cannon here. Nobody's protecting her. Or me. Gives us all our buffs and healing. And level 14. Awesome. I thank you for coming to our aid. That was a tight spot you saved us from. And what luck! Nary a scratch on the wares to show for it. Okay. I'd wager I mean, I was just trying to survive, here. but we ought okay. To take a closer look. <laughs> so we are about at a point where we are going to end the video. So what I'll do is I'll run all the way back over here. I'll cut the video to when I'm back over here and that's where we'll end the video. So with that being said, I will see everybody in just a moment. Alrighty everyone, this is where we're gonna end the video. I wanna start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean a lot to me. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button if you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.